Hey, James here. Um, so, I got the N900, the Nokia N900 with the MIMO operating system, and I've been using it for uh, about three weeks now, and I actually really like it. I've learned some of the ins and outs of it, and I'm going to take my N900, I'm going to reset it back to factory defaults and do a series of videos about some of the features and things that you can do with it. I don't know what I'm going to do. I might actually break the phone, so um, let's see what happens. Go to wiki.memo.org slash flasher and you'll get all these nice instructions about how to flash your device. But I've already downloaded the files I needed and I'm going to So the first thing we need to do is take our N900 and turn it off. And then we need to connect the USB cable to the device while holding down the U key. What we should eventually see is a screen pop up. It's dark and low power mode and there should be a little USB icon in the corner. It's really hard to see but it's in there. And then we're ready. And my virtual machine does find the USB device and called it a Nokia device. Okay, let's see what happens if we start the update process. It is loading something, sending and flashing. Success! The device is just sitting here with nothing on screen. Let me turn the light back on. Um, except Nokia and the little USB icon in the upper right corner. Successful! Device reboots. There we go. And success we have the initial startup screen asking me for my time settings and everything. So let's see here. We're gonna go ahead and start this up from scratch. English, USA, and my time zone is that's Seattle. That's right, Microsoft Country. Uh, and the uh, date and time is correct already because this phone was already set up previously, so the date and time didn't change. Save. <laughs> there I am in the in the reflection. That's how shiny it is. And let's see if we get the default screen. And that looks like it. Just a big bunch of nothing. But uh, there should be four screens available. Come on, there we go. That's the default screen with the phone, the email, and the contacts. Twitter, Facebook, a blank screen and nothing. And the Memo Select and OVI store. Now let's double check to make sure that the, that the application manager doesn't have the extra settings that I set earlier. check the application catalogs and yep it has a standard Nokia applications Nokia system software updates and the memo extras is actually turned off that is the default setting all right finally the last thing we're going to do is we're going to flash the, the um, internal memory uh, where some of my data might be stored um, even though we set the OS back to factory defaults um, there are some things in there like um, call timers, contacts, calendars that were saved in a separate area of memory. Um, now you might read that this is unnecessary. Actually there's other ways to delete this but I'm just gonna wipe it out. And again you can find that information at wiki.memo.org. Execute the command. It says device not found and while it says device not found we're gonna plug in the USB cable to the device that's turned off. Alright and pressing the U key while plugging in the USB device um, it is now flashing 
the vanilla eMMC yeah. file course, up uh, into the N900. Uh, at this point, since it's over and everything is finished happening on the screen, it actually is safe to pull up the USB cable. Give it a few seconds to realize the cable's out. And then um, now I'm going to hold the startup button. And all we want to do now is make sure that the timers, the contacts, calendar events and so forth are now wiped out from my phone. The only thing that should remain is anything that's on my SD card. Okay, the device started up. There's no calendar events. Let's take a look and see if there's any contacts. Nope, all the contacts are gone. Now let's see if there's any call timers in the phone. No recent calls. And that's it. Your Nokia device is fully reset and that's it for this video. Um, join us um, in the next video or subscribe uh, to find out uh, what we're going to do next. Um, we're going to think of some good things.